Hello and welcome back everybody. This is Bigging Country here on Thanksgiving Day here. Just finished up with the family and uh, we usually don't spend too too long out and uh, eating turkey that slowly but surely makes you sleepier than hell. So now that we are finished with that and the family has finished gathering, we are back to this. Our world away from home. In this case, in the middle of a hermit cave, which is slowly but surely expanding. Hooray. Now, nonetheless, reviewing everything from yesterday while uploading it to YouTube, I figured this may not work as well as I want it. It works for now, but I want storage, battery storage of some type. And I know there's a mod here called Cyclic where they have battery storage, which is nice, and I want to get into that, if possible. And then second as well, is I want to automate this a little bit better than this, maybe with like a bigger tank, if possible, because this is all, just only so much. And by tank, I'm thinking of drums. The drums mod is in here, which different types of storage for fluid, for more and more and I want to make this so it's all drums and being that you can make so many of these with just one recipe I think 64 I'm thinking I just want to take all of this expand it even farther so it just goes on oh, it's underground which because of the morph mod oh not that one um, but nonetheless though with the morph mod I can do this oh, that was a the wrong thing to hit And because of this now, I can do this, get super, super low to the ground, and uh, yeah, one block high, I can just dig everything out and put a drum right here, running all the way from over here. I may even expand that backwards that way a little bit more, just for the sake of have this having some room over here in case we want to automate anything else. And if we do automate anything, that'll go back in that area, which is what I wouldn't mind doing. <laughs> And then at some point, maybe doing some little more decoration just to make the inside of here look a little bit nicer. But that will have to wait as we have many things to do. Let's see here. Oh, chickens are laying eggs. This is 84, so I should get another chicken soon that won't glitch into the wall and just randomly die, which would be nice. I may expand this. Because I want to just make a huge, huge grassy area. And I can only go so far that way, which is kind of annoying. Oh yeah, I don't have my gloves on. And because of this, I can only go so far back with that. But I'm thinking of doing a whole underground area. Oh, that's actually working a little bit better now. I want a whole, like, maybe dig a stairway with actual stairs. Wood just to kind of keep the idea. And I'm probably going to dig this downward after I dredge that out a little bit more. And then make a huge, huge, almost plateau-sized, like, full-on automated farm. Where everything is collected in here and sent up via transfer nodes up to a crate. Which that also, mo that mod's in here as well, which I want to um, put on over here. And because of that... I can have like 30 of these things, as well as I can also build a much bigger farm than just food sustaining. Which, even that's limited because these things are absolutely amazing. 
So there's really no point. Um, I'm just gonna plant a crud ton of everything that I have over there, as well as a huge sugarcane farm, so I can have all the resources I need. In this case, hay, so I can make these things, and so on and so forth. If I remember correctly, I think I can put multiples in these in here. Yes, I can. So it speeds it up or get more out of it. Okay, so it speeds it up. Okay, that's good to know. And also, since this is almost done, actually, I'm curious as to what actually comes out of this. I've not actually seen what comes out of an egg. The only thing I knew is, is that things would randomly spawn. I'm assuming a chicken. They would get stuck in here, suffocate, which I could not hear. And there'd just be random things just sitting right here, which I picked up and, well, I got golden lakes from it. Don't ask me how or why. But I'm curious as to if it pops up one of these guys over here. Because normally how those guys came from was chicken bait. Chicken bait you put next to a water source on grass, and you get a chicken in this mod pack. It's interesting. They come out of nowhere, but it works. And yes, that's exactly what it does. Good to know. Well, since I'm thinking about it, I'll just put another one on here. Oh, I already had one. I'm an idiot. Cool. You guys stand there. And now, we are going to go figure out what we're going to do next here. And my idea is a couple things. I want to get these water mills in here from extra utilities too. Because when you hold these things, you get a grid power. And how these guys work is for the amount of water flow around each end. Obviously, the closer to the water source, the better. Around each side of it, you will get anywhere between four to six from it. And I have one over here just because it's hidden, but it's not going to work that well over here cutting off my walkway. And I don't want to do that. So I want to figure out how to put the rest of these in as well and how I'm going to do that. And yeah. So P. Oop. Wait, can I just do this on anything? Okay, that's awesome. I, I just... I. I was looking through mods and I saw this as a thing. It says press P, place things. I didn't know what it meant, but I think I do now. P. P. And I'm going to do then plant one of these right here. Make it obvious what is what. And because I'm able to do that now. I'll be able to separate these with less issue and it'll be like, oh, that's that. Okay, cool to know. And I'll just put this draconic block on here because I have no use for it right now. And it'll just tell me what's always there. One other thing I want to look at though is furnaces. There is a mod in here that will allow a furnace that will like burn tiny coal at a much more efficient rate, cook things faster regardless of what it is and we'll give you four slots. It only has one slot for cooking, but it has four of these slots here. And I need to look up exactly what that is, so. I know that's within my ability to make, and I actually would like to make it. Let's see, where's a normal furnace here? Simple powered, no. Where's a normal furnace so I can click on it? You know what? You know, let's just do this. Now. Here we go. Uses crafting. So I know, here it is. Nope, that's Federation Chamber. That's for that. That's an oven. Huh. That's cool. But no. Um, Tail confuser. Nothing I need. Fuel wood heater. I know what it looks like because I saw the mod as well as the picturing on it. But I want to find it first. I'll well, have to find it first before I can do anything. Let's see. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, I forgot about this mod. This thing right here, you can put anything into it. And obviously, the better the value the more energy it'll make, but it will like literally make energy out of anything. 
including cobblestone, which means I could just have energy out of this, but obviously cobblestone does not have a very high EMC uh, versus one of these things. So obviously the higher the EMC or whatever the heck it rates it on will give you more pretty much power. It's obviously not free. It uses up the item as if it's like coal or something else. But within that time, it'll give you the value of that, which is nice. So basically, if you got a cobblestone generator, free power. It's going to be slower, but it's free. But we'll worry about that a little bit later. I want to look for specifically that dang furnace that I found. That's a LA smelter. Here it is, iron furnace. So I need four of these and five iron. Okay. That's what I want to make because it is much more realistic than burning through so much on these. Let's see, grab some iron here. Uh, iron furnace. There we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Whoop, I made too many. Whoops. Okay. One, two, three. Basically making these guys pretty much obsolete at this point. Because they're very wasteful in their normal state. And not really worth my time. But these guys, on top of aesthetics, if I, oop, wrong thing. If I do this, it goes much quicker. And normally one tiny coal works for one item a piece. Because of how efficient and fast it is, it's more realistic. And you get two items per tiny coal, which means with a normal coal, you get, instead of eight, you get 16, which is actually what I wouldn't mind. It'd be much, much more appreciated. Oh, this is going to be beautiful. Let's see if I find another tiny coal real quick. There it is. I filled these guys up. I said they can't shift click them in, but whatever. And that's just an example. I don't really need too much stone because I have a trick for that, actually. What that trick includes is, and I will show you here, one of these guys. A chisel. That's actually how I did all of this. Now, with a chisel, obviously you can make any a bunch of fancier blocks. Like this right here, this is all from Chisel Mod, and so is this. This is either chisel or normal Minecraft. But... There's a trick to this. If you left click, you can click on it, but it stays stone. And if anyone knows how stones work, as far as stone bricks, if you break it, it stays stone. Now you can keep it this way and still consider it a crafting, uh, crafting with stone, doesn't matter. Or if you specifically want stone, there you go. No more smelting in order to get stone. I can just hit, get a bunch of these at once and it goes as fast as you can move around. Every single one of these without skipping a beat. And it's beautiful. And keep clicking on it if you want very specific things. Or just kind of do whatever. And I love Chisel so much because of that. Chisel is awesome because of that, which is so nice. But, once again, don't really need much stone. What I really want, though. Actually, let me see my swords in here. I want some bones. So I want to make more porcelain stuff. Oh, they despawned. Oh, that's sad. Uh, where are you, creeper? There. You are. Yep, nope, don't explode. No exploding for creeper. Die, dang it. Why do you not die? There we go. Haha. -ha. I am waiting for more skeletons more than anything, but they don't seem to like me. That and zombies for jerky. Eh, whatever. Worst comes to worst, I'll have to make the old-fashioned platform and water, but at least I don't have to actually build it, I just have to dig it, which will be nice, which means if I really wanted to, I could dig a, use my stairway actually over here, dig down this way like 30 some odd blocks, have it where it comes down here where I can just whack at their feet and they drop like 25, 30 blocks down. 
Oh, let's see here. And I'm also going to replace this into a different spot. I'm going to put this right there. Oh, well, maybe not, not, not the way I was expecting to do it. I should do this right here. So that every time they poop or whatever, it'll be collected in one spot. 76%. Okay, cool. Put you in there. Now let's get to some real work. Hmm. Well, first I guess we can get some dirt down. I have to make some more as well. Put that in there. Put that there. Put this there. And let's get some of this down. I have to make a compressing for that. A couple of things too. They did figure out ancient spores are still in here, so I can still get my psyllium via ancient spores, which is nice. But the bigger problem is I still need to sift a lot of sand apparently in order to get to it. So at least X Nala for the most part is still normal. It still has the normal drops for sifting. And I guess that's a good thing. Oop. But in order to do that, I need a lot of sand and I'll worry about that a little bit later because what I want is dirt. Use whatever I can of the dirt. And then once I don't need any more, the rest I'll use as uh, make turn the sand. Oop. Lay this all out of here. Thank God for the speediness of some of the mods. Let's see, let's see. There we go. Make a crud ton of dirt here. Oh, I hate that. I wish, it, I really do wish it would just kind of get all of it at once, which would be super, super nice. But, yeah, it has its limits. Now, into the, my new farm for trees. Get this whole thing covered in oak saplings between for oak trees or whatever saplings I have, birch and so on. And if I want to get some of the other darker woods, I will need, obviously, a uh, taller ceiling, being some of the normal Minecraft trees are very, very tall. Cool. I actually used about every single one of them I had, almost, except for eight of them, apparently. So that's not going to be a lot of sand to try to go for ancient spores of any type. Oh, I'm getting hungry here. So let's see any saplings. Birch and oak. And a lot of oak, actually. I do like the white look of the oak, uh, the birch, which is nice. And I kind of want to keep that. And that's the reason why these are actually my main centerpieces of my spawn. So. Let's see. Let's get these guys over here. I will suck this too is I may need to expand a little bit this way for some of the trees on this edge. Let's get these down before I run out of room. These guys don't necessarily produce the biggest trees in the world, but that's perfectly fine. Ow. And sure as crud. Okay then. That's not fun. <laughs> Excuse me. So that was unexpected. Apparently running around, um, not twerking, caused it to uh, just grow up randomly. And which then entrapped me inside of it and started to suffocate me. Yay! Gotta love it. 
Huh, okay. That is technically a first for me. I don't think I've ever had that happen. I've had it with leaves, which you can still breathe in. But I've never had a habit with a full-on tree growing. That was interesting, to say the least. Put you in there. I should keep this on me. Put you in here, though. And now I need to make a ton of sand. You know what? I will take these down. Because I can do this and I'll get the sand back from them. What happened to the fourth one? How the heck did... Oh, I know why. There we go. Now, time to lay them all out again. I wonder if a triple compressed or double compressed can be just destroyed all at once. That would actually be interesting to find out. all the sand. I don't think my hammer is going to have enough for every one of these. In any way, in any capacity. Oh wait, it did? Holy crud, okay. I do want to make a few more of these, though, these sieves. Because if I just put them all in this portion here, I can do... Ten, at a, ten of these things at a time, which would actually be fairly nice here. Hmm, you know, let's see if I can do that. So... Is this a normal one? Four, one, one. Okay. So, I can do this then. That'll count for one of them. Oh, I can, okay, that's already taken actually. Okay, that's actually pretty dope. Three. There we go. Sweet, sweet. That is awesome. Let's get rid of those, get rid of that. Grab this, I might grab the iron too. Because I need to make them all iron base. Wait, do I have enough flint for that even? I have enough for a few of them, crud. Well, let's hope this will work then. So... I think I only have enough one for one of these, but you know what? I can use it to still sieve the rest. I wonder if I need to upgrade each one of them, though. No, I'm gonna just try it, see if I just upgrade it as is. Because if it works, then we're in a golden position here. Okay, so it does not work that way, that way at all. Well, still good to know. Five sieves. We'll go one, two, three, four, five. Too bad the big ones don't work in the same way or I would just only be using two big ones. So we'll do this center one for that one. Two, three, four. And there we go. Now this should all work. 
Okay, only the ones are the same. Do they all work the same way? Okay, so that's good to know. Prosperity shard, what? The heck is a prosperity shard? Give me a spore of ancientness. I need you for witch water. And then I can make soul sand out of you. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uranium Grit, Osmium Electret, Project Redcore. I don't think I've messed with that very much. Huh. Well, that wasn't what I was hoping for in any way, shape, or form. Because I may need some more diamonds, which means I may have to take a run up to the uh, mining dimension here soon because... Oh, crud. That's, that's, that's going to get slightly irritating. Well, nonetheless, you know, I just saw some. Did I even get any bone meal out of that? Oh, wait, no, I need dust. Oh, crud. Well, then. Put you in here. Put you in there. So, nope. I even put the dang things on them to tell me which ones are what. Dang. These ones go into here. I just gotta take that out. Yeah, I'll leave that for now. And throw those in there. Put you in there. And I think we'll be golden for now. Let's go check on this farm. Definitely working. I wonder how many I can make grow all at once. Oh, bunches. Oh, that worked. That worked fairly well and really quickly. Oh, baby. So I would need a crutch on a string. That'll be my way to do it. But did not give me as many as I was hoping of saplings, which means I guess I need to crook the living hell out of these every time. Huh, okay. Didn't mean any apples either. Perfect. Well, let's do that. Gave me a lot of wood though. Let's see. Who are you talking to? I don't even know how, where the heck I got that from, but okay. Random reward. Invar hammer. Ooh, okay. Base crafting seeds. Infuse crystals, master infusion crystals. Oh, I get it. You get all these, you can make all these types of different things. As well as you can also grow more of these, it looks like. Huh. Oh, excuse me. If everyone knows the thing about turkey making you sleepy, oh my god. Oh, that is definitely happening to me. I haven't been up that long either. Hmm. What should I do? There's more mobs over there. I got more chickens over here. Hmm. I 
I did say I was gonna make a drum. But I think that may have to wait for a short time because I think I need to take a run up to the mining dimension to be completely honest here. That's something I definitely should do. Hmm. Anyway, as well. Uh, excuse me. I'm definitely tired. As fast as lightning to the mining dimension. Run, run as fast as you can. I am back in you again and this time it's serious holy crud there's still a bunch of cobble on here left huh. let's grab some more stuff that was gonna happen Not actually as far as I went with the hammer originally. Huh. I like lead ore, I like silver ore. This time I don't have to actually waste this. Perfect. Oh, I cannot wait to get reactors going. I will have unlimited energy. Actually, my dire world, uh, my dire wolf pack. I actually have a decent sized reactor and what I did with it was I attached it to a huge home battery system inside of my little laboratory slash home and I have that battery system happens to be oh what the hell okay um like a 12 by 12 no one two three four five Six, it's a six by six or something like that. Six by nine. I don't remember exactly how many or what. It's just a huge, huge, huge cube that I had to set myself. Oh, nether quartz, yes. That I had to set myself that could all transfer the energy between itself. So one side's in, one side's out. And any energy brought from the front end of it will automatically go right to the back, which is nice. But the problem with it is is even though they're all resonant energy cells from thermal um they still have their little drawback which is sometimes they don't read correctly because of how many are in one area and how many are trying to send out a signal all at once so it tends to get a little bit weird down again and also i, I heard that where, where, where was that skelly not over here I hear you, but I don't know where you are, dang skeleton. I need your bones. Oh, there we go. Don't really need any more redstone right now. Nickel's always nice to have, even though it's not the most necessary right now. Ooh, a little bit more yellowium. Let's invar this direction. 
Oh, heck yeah, more coal. I'm just gonna keep going this direction until I run out of uh, hammer, I guess. Three more hits, probably. Oh. Or until I hit that. Oh, spawn some bats in here, too. <laughs> Let's see here. I'll take you. Oh, there's actually quite a lot over here. I already have 64, huh? Eh? That's what you think. Give me more. These always come in handy because there's no nether, so these are going to be amazing to have. That's it. You gave me that promise of something epic, you damn cave. Well, okay then. Space for that too, huh? No, I did not. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Redstone, I don't really care for again. I don't really care for black quartz too much. Let me go two over. Okay. I see your game there. Give me to the last one, then tease me. <laughs> I like how whenever you find lead or silver, you're always going to find each other in the same area. There's got to be that one last one. Only because of the words in it, I'm not going to have that one playing. Ooh, that was a huge chunk. Gonna need those later, anyways. What the heck is that? Oh, more of this stuff? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, hello there. Are you my nice neighbor? Oh, now you're coming after me. I don't think he knows what to do. I mean, he does now, but I don't think he knew what to do. He just kind of sat there. <laughs> She scared me as well as I go, crap, I just fell into something. 
Okay. Don't need any aluminum. I got tons of that I haven't used. I'm gonna go up here actually and get this stuff. I still have no idea, even from the dire pack, I have no idea what really to do with dimensional shards. Oh yeah, this stuff again. You know, I'll grab it only because I don't know what it is used for, and I want to know. Why? Well, what's this stuff? Oh, tin. No, say it's not going in. I was like, oh yeah, that's why. Oh, here we go. I like having this stuff because I'm going to be... Oh, what the heck? Uh, lag spike. Okay. No idea why, but okay. I keep forgetting. There's always going to be more of this stuff. There we go. There we go. Too much, but I like having more. There we go. Uh, uranium, sure. How am I doing? Just do this. There we go. Oh, there's, there's more. I just didn't even grab it for it, did I? There we go. Okay, I shot him up here, but I never came up here. What the heck is wrong with me? Oh, and there's a spider. Yes, that's what I want to hear. I gotta go find him. Him, her, I don't discriminate. It's gonna be dead regardless. over there more oh there you are come here give me a spider eye please give me a spider eye give me a spider eye give me a spider eye oh thank the lord known uh get rid of that usually i don't care for spider eyes i never have but in a mod pack like this everything is useful in some way even the most originally useful useless things in the world become one of your best things in the world if you can get the, your hands on them. Let's see. Get some more of this stuff. Osmond, did I already have some of that already? Guess not. Sure. So I only have the dust is what I've picked up so far. And the ingots I get from that, but I can get double that much quicker. Sweet. Oh, hello. Ooh, yeah, very nice haul from this run. Thank God there is a mining dimension in this mod pack. 
Or a lot of people would be very upset sometimes. <laughs> oh my god. What? Looks like I ran out of room for all that. Well, I might probably anymore. Let's go back. If I can get this emerald first. The heck did I just pick up? Rare Earth Earth? What? Still have no idea what that's used for. I still gotta figure that out. No, there's more that way. Good to know for the future. Um. Oh, dang. Now, of course, I gotta figure out how to get out of here now. Oh, here we go. I think I recognize this way, actually. Yay, I do. There we go. Let's head on back. Uh, yep. There we go, running speed. First thing I'm thinking at some point, possibly off camera, I might just make a normal mob drop farm. Where I just drop them down through with water on an 8x8 uh, or 5x5 platform. Um, 8 blocks out um, from a source. Goes in, they drop in, yada yada. I might just maybe make a small one of those maybe. And then they can grow it as big as I need later. Let's go throw you guys in here. Got more dimensional shards in here. I got quite a lot, so I don't need any more of these anymore. But I do want to get into this, though. Inferium. It's coal. Metals can stay in here. The rest of this will most likely be ground up. Put you in there. So I can do all of that. that so everything's nice and charged and powered the entire time sure now it's actually telling me the how much is in there for once this one just does not want to there's none of resident that has sent it up yet crud oh well, looks like I go make more It's a lot of blanks. Cool. That should give me enough for a bucket's worth. So that's a full, that's a full. And this one's just getting up to full power. I don't want these exploding. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, heck yeah. 
Not often do you get a mining dimension on top of, oh crud, on top of the fact that you also have to do a normal survival type thing. I pretty much have no room in this thing. I'm gonna have to start getting a crate soon. Yeah, I do actually do it more bone meal actually. Sweet. Uh, tiny coals. Crud. I'm gonna actually throw something in here. No, I can't. Dang it, I won't even hold on to it. There's extra. Right, I'll throw them in here. Why not? My shoulders at you. There we go. Now this can go through it quicker. That'd be much nicer. But I need to do an upgrade on it, like an Invar upgrade kit, or Harden specifically, in order for that to work. Okay. Um. I'm gonna pick up aluminum ore anyways. Whoops. Put the tin in here. Uh, oh yeah, we got my bucket. <laughs> Do I need like an upgrade or something for this? What? I have the resin funnel use. Sap. Use. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. How do I get resin then? I put a resin funnel in. So where the heck did they get sap from? Um, why? Why does that not work? Ah. Well, that's not nice. Huh. Interesting. Well, that was a wasted bucket. Use. I will have none. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, you've got to be crap, me, man. I did not read that for the life of me. Okay, I feel like an idiot. Just not an idiot. So I actually need birch to get resin. Great. Ah, okay. Really? Fermenting barrel, don't need that yet. Where the heck is the normal barrels? Crates. Uh, 
I can do that. Do a 64 stack of this. Crates and crates. Chest of storages. Okay. Chest. Much better. I just have too much in it right now. Let's grab all of this. Oh, not those. Oh, yeah, I do have a couple of these. Ooh, I know what I can do with those. I definitely know what I can do with those. <laughs> there we go. So now the chests are pretty much obsolete at this point because of how big these sons of bitches are. Oh, it's so nice. It's so nice. That's something so big. I know that's not what she said. Cool, cool, cool. So I'm gonna put these right next to each other and they'll stop screwing with me because then one will be for that and one will be for that. guys in here. I did mention storage I was going to work on, and this is definitely storage. Sweet. I can get rid of you. Like I said, so nice. And that could just stay right there. So. Hmm. You in there. This in there. At least I would listen to the noise of this thing opening up. It would be three seconds, too, which is always nice. Put the lead in there. Oh, yeah, I put this here for this exact reason. In case I had extra. Sweet, 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 sweet. Uh, I need more seeds. So I borrow a couple from here. Nope, I cannot. They've used them all making babies. So, do the next, next thing. Wait, 
Wait, do these things float? They do. Oh, heck yeah. Might as well make some more bait while I'm at it. You in here. I absolutely cannot waste this. Yeah, good enough. Does connect to it? Yes, it does. Sweet. Throw that in there. Throw that in there. Now, veggie bait. Should go back into here. Oh, that worked out perfectly. Everything was collected right there. Oh, heck yeah. I think I gotta make a few more of those soon. Chicken. So how have you been doing here? Six more you guys. Put you in here and super speed this up. Because I like free things. Hmm. Man, I really gotta figure out what the heck I want to do here. Pour some clay. Need 14 in total. And you know what? I can do that. Cool, cool, cool. Throw these guys into here. And then we wait. For about three seconds. Yay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Two more of these guys. I said I was gonna make a drum. So I might as well stay on that word there. So if I remember the recipe, which is old to me, I think I need, like, two of these guys, and I think, uh... Oh, wait, 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 no, I need to make a cauldron, I think, actually. And then something like this. Oh, okay, I was close. I just had to add the things on the sides as well. But I got it. <laughs> now this will also hold a hell of a lot more as well. Oh. Oh. Spam. Scam. Whatever you want to call it. There we go. There we go. And what I'll do is I have this drum come out this direction. This time I'm actually keep his contents. And then with three of these running. Oh, god dang it. I forgot. I still need one more. Fuck it, because I lost my other one. Two resin sap, whatever. I 
This is a thicket about it as well. has already made it, might as well not waste it. Two times, right zero? Oh, three times. That's two. That's two. So one, so underneath, directly underneath each other is what I want. So this one will have its own source block. And this one will as well. Which will make it all three times. I may run out of lava sooner than I run out of cobble. <laughs> there we go. Crook time. Plenty of saplings. I think I may have to make it more of a birch forest, so obviously I want the apples and all this stuff. But it's not gonna help me if they don't grow. Grow, birch, grow. Hey no 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 problem growing before. Come on. Not you. How many sassed you? Now get back down. Grow, birch. You're not in the right area to grow, are you? Hmm, let's try something a little bit different here. the center there's no reason why you cannot grow right here at least one of you grow dang it go they really do not like growing this tiny little area do they like these guys are having zero problem even right on the edge but the birches do not like sharing the same plot with normal oak. Huh. Very interesting. Yet, within the time I was waiting for just one birch to grow, two of these guys grew up. Let's see what happens with that. Hmm. And then we got this, 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 this actually. This all going here. I actually need some more of that. You know what? I'm gonna take all of these 
I'm gonna set them all up for success here. my butt off Oop. just so these can infest every leaf nearby <laughs> Cobble to stone. I'll bring two. Nice well. Couldn't hurt anybody. How do you do that? Fested already. Holy crap. That was quick. They get everywhere already? Everything. All the way around is fully infested. Oh, heck yeah. Holy crap. I think I have string to last me for just about ever. Oh, heck yeah. And then, got them all down. Got everything, yes, I did. Stick, string, string. Holy crud, just off of that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, almost ten stacks of string from that. Oh, yeah, I am set for life for that one. Let's grab my apples. I wonder if you can cook a peach. No, you cannot. Good to know. Hmm. Those are my sticks. I think I know exactly what I want to do here, actually. Make as many as I can. Use. Let's 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I need one more. That's it. <laughs> That's interesting. I don't need that one. So I remember also no I remember seeing in something else. Shift K. Wait, what? Wait, what? I know there's a different way to do things. Didn't think I was going to do that. Okay, then. <laughs> oh, wait. I think I need to be at one of these. Shift K. Okay. Okay, that works. That makes sense now. That's why it gave me two more of these. I don't know. But, with what I heard as far as Shift K goes, depending on what type of crafting ability you have, or what type of table you're in, it'll auto-craft it in whatever the full size of the thing is, which is actually fairly nice. So doing something like this is fairly easy. Um, why are always a couple left? Always at the end. Oh, there we go. Oh, no, there's some more. Good enough. I'll set this auto run for a second. automatically though popping into my inventory though I don't know why it's not and the goal here is to try to get at least a little bit more flint because that would be nice And yes, I do very much understand that this is not exactly the most fun thing to be watching. But sadly, it is part of surviving. It's not like Minecraft, you go out and go mining or farming, whatever like that. It's not like I'm going to be battling things very often. 
Unless, of course, I leave a spot that's unlit by a torch randomly. Wink, wink. And this is pretty much your main way of getting most, if not all, resources. So I'm kind of forced to do it this way. Obviously, the mine dimension does exist. But I don't always feel like wasting that much iron up there. Because a lot of things, in order to get a lot of these, you need iron. And I'd rather save that for what I really want it for. Let's actually get rid of all this and do this. Ha 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 I should not automatically switch this me, okay. Now, as I said before in the beginning of the stream, I do apologize. I'm getting a little bit tired. A lot of turkey, very full from earlier. And now I'm, even though I'm out of the food coma, I'm getting very, very sleepy now, or starting to. So it's like, uh, eh. But I'm trying to stay awake for the sake of content Because if I don't, well, then they're just going to see an empty stream of me not moving. Or just repeating an action, which I'm not even touching any controls. I'm possibly snoring while I'm sleeping in my uh, cozy spinning chair. How much did I get of what I'm looking for? None of what I'm looking for. You gotta be crap me. I got zero flint out of that whole thing. I mean, ton of iron, copper, some nickel, a lot of lead, a lot of osmium. Actually, a lot of iron, actually. Silver, more, a ton of tin. Ton of aluminum again. And a ton of these crystals. Well, crud. Let me see what this does. Cool, more potato seeds. Go in there. Yeah, it's been almost an hour and a half, and as I mentioned, also obviously it's the holidays, and. It's not even 7.30 where I am. Yeah, it's about 10 minutes off, and I'm already this tired. If that's kind of sad. <laughs> and I think I'm starting to get sick, sadly, as well, because of that. So, I think for the sake of better content, I'm going to wait till I'm a little more awake, a little more enthusiastic than I am, because I'm just going to be very limited with how I am this way, which kind of sucks. And even I noticed that. I'm not exactly doing the best of production value right now. I'm not exactly being the most entertaining in the world. And it just doesn't seem fair. Or may not just be entertaining entirely to anyone that may seem interested at all in what I'm doing. So in order to save everybody, and I guess you can say save face, I guess we'll call it here for the day. Thank you very much. This is Bacon Country, and I'll see you next time when I have a little more energy and I'm a little more enthusiastic.